Irrigation canals slice through the landscape. Water trickles into lush green fields, a picture unimaginable just a few years ago in the mountainous region of Gilgit Baltistan in northern Pakistan. This is thanks to an EFAT-supported irrigation system stretching over hundreds of kilometers, which has transformed the scenery and changed the lives of almost 90,000 people. There was a lot of water that you saw yourself. When the water came from, تقریباً ستر پرسنٹ ہم نے زمین آباد کی ہے اور اس چینل کے بنانے پر ہمارے گھر فق میں اتنی خوشحالی آئی ہے کہ جس کا کوئی ہم حساب ہی نہیں کر سکتے And it was no small achievement. Nestled between the world's tallest mountain ranges, Gilgit Baltistan's harsh terrain makes the movement of people and goods prohibited. It is a semi-arid region where farmers rely primarily on rain-fed agriculture. In recent years, rising temperatures and the increasingly erratic rainfalls induced by climate change have made farming more and more challenging. Before EFAD support, the lack of prospects and the increasing food insecurity led many to migrate towards cities in search of jobs, only to find themselves in competition with higher skilled and better educated workers. What they needed was more opportunities to earn a living at home. Education, infrastructure, is the most important priority for both government as well as for the uh, communities uh, living in these mountainous uh, areas. Therefore, investment in irrigation and land development was included as one of the components in the Economic Transformation Initiative, which is a project assisted by IFA and co-funded by government of Gitkit uh, Pakistan and the Italian cooperation. The Economic Transformation Initiative, or ETI, gave way to the construction of more than 400 kilometers of irrigation canals, a new source of water that has allowed nearly 30,000 farmers to double their arable land. And the project is not limited to irrigation. To date, almost 400 kilometers of roads have been built to connect farmers to markets. Farmers and water use associations manage resources, incentivize community-driven development, and provide microcredit schemes to reinvest in future initiatives. Vulnerable groups like women and youth can access credit and support at more favorable conditions. And land titles for the newly irrigated lands are issued. Additional training on better farming, storage, and processing practices helped many farmers gain the necessary skills to turn subsistence farming into commercial activities. I am a member of Building irrigation canals is not a new idea. Local communities here first discussed the issue more than 60 years ago. But it wasn't until IFAD became involved that it was possible to raise the necessary funds. This channel is our father بزرگوں کے لیے ایک بہت بڑا خواب تھا کہ یہ چینل بن جائے تو ہمارے لیے خوراک کا مسئلہ حل ہو جائے گا دیز نیو ارگیشن کینالس ہیو گیون فارمرز ان دا ریجن فوڈ سیکیورٹی اینڈ دا چانس ٹو انکریز دیئر مارکیٹس ان ایئرس ٹو کم